Gretchen and Kate Pawnee, which is actually a mother-daughter team competing at the Retired Racehorse Project's Thoroughbred Makeover. Now, Kate is here with her horse, Sailor's Creek, and she's gonna tell us a little bit about how her round went in the jumper division that she already competed today. Um, so I just finished about uh, 15 minutes ago. Um, he was, Sailor was super good, um, just a bit strong. In the warm up, he was a little bit strong, but uh, we lunged him and he worked out of it. Um, and we had a couple stops, but they weren't naughty at all. He was just race pace mostly. <laughs> and tell us a little bit about Sailor. What's his pedigree like? What was his race record like? How did you come to find him? Um, he is, uh, he won about 338,000 on the track. Um, and he had about 30 something starts. Um, and we got him from a, Ann Smith. from Ann Smith in <laughs> St. Louis. He was at the fairgrounds in Louisiana. In Louisiana. So that's where my mom picked him up and, um, she found him and we just had him shipped over to, um, St. Louis. And that's where we went and picked him up in the, uh, pass in March this past March but we also have her mother who's competing in the jumpers and competitive trail I did the two foot hunters this morning um, on my horse Emil he's a seven-year-old off the track horse obviously um, won about 250,000 running claiming races so bless his heart he's run a lot um, and he's a really good hunter tomorrow I'm doing competitive trail which is a totally different thing because um, I'm a hunter jumper trainer so that's not in my wheelhouse but um, we hope to compete well and we're going to do obstacles and do a six mile loop around the park at one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Awesome and would you guys say that you have been lifelong thoroughbred fans or was something about this show did it convince you to get a thoroughbred? I have been uh, rehabbing racehorses for probably the past six or seven years. I've had multiple projects, um, and I did the Retired Racehorse Project last year with a gray horse named Chuck's Turn um, and did the Field Hunters with him. And I just love this horse show. This, this show, uh, more than any of the others that we go to, the people here are here for the right reasons. They want to rebuild the thoroughbred. They, they want what's good for the horse. Um, and so it's our favorite horse show to come to, absolutely. Um, so there you go. And now Sailor is for sale, correct? Yes, he is for sale. <laughs> and what, what can you tell us about what would be his perfect match, what's his price, and what can people do if they want to get in contact with you? Um, well, he, uh, if you want to get in contact with him, contact my mom, Gretchen Pawnee. <laughs> um, she's like my uh, manager. Um, and I think, we were just talking about earlier, I think he'd be, um, he has a really good brain for eventing. Um, but since we are just doing jumpers today, um, I think he would also do great um, as a hunter. Um, price, Mama? I, we don't have him priced at this <laughs> point, but uh, make us an offer. <laughs> yeah, so a good home is the good most home. crucial oh, yeah. part of yes. this. Absolutely. We get really attached to these horses, um, and we're kind of terrible at the whole marketing and treating them like a number. We really get attached to them, so it has to be the right home, um, somebody that would take really good care of him and, and keep him going.